The great current of the Indian Ocean continues to push us northwards through warm tropical waters. The monsoon came, and with it some very unwelcome visitors. Nothing less than a plague of snakes who cause no end of pain, suffering and anxious moments among the rest of us. Never before have we been in such dire need of expert help. And what a mischance that Vulture Patrol, in their search of the mainland, could only locate the one mongoose who had given up fighting snakes. Deary be. But once again, our dire predicament forced us to find a solution. One morning long ago, when I was a cub in Canada, my mother took me down to the shore and it was thick with oil. All the dead fish, the seabirds. I never thought I'd see such a thing again. But now, here, on my dear little island. Oh, deary be. I did warn it, didn't I? Keep out of the water, I said. But it took no notice, see? Right, I've got the coconut milk to get the oil off. Ruth, no blink and use at all. What? If he was to drink the milk, then when he sweats it out, it can melt the oil off from the inside. Yeah, all right. I'm game. No, no, squirt him all over with lemon juice. That'll work, I betcha. No, 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 no. Chalk, see, absorbs the oil. Wrap him in chalk, I say. Actually, loves. Peanut butter, that's the stuff. And, uh, Reg, as it happens, I've just made a batch. Yeah, my own special recipe. Peanut butter? How did you manage to make peanut butter? It's easy, I'll tell you. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Yuck! That's disgusting! Of course, if I had some peanuts and some butter, it might help. <laughs> Thank you, Jasper. Nab? Nab! Noah calling Nab! Noah calling Nab! Hello, Captain! Uh, Nab at your service. What can I do you for, sir? Just received a message from Jasper. What did he say? He said, ooh, 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 um, uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, that's good news, Captain. There's a wee skinny gap in the oil. If we punch through it, we can take shelter by the mainland. Marvellous. Let's do it, Nab. Full speed to port side, pronto. Ha-ha, <laughs> we did it. We're through. And with the wind blowing off the land, we're safe here. I think we're getting somewhere now. What is that stuff she is using? It's a combination, isn't it? Of lemon juice, coconut milk, Reggie's peanut butter and chalk. Is it working? If it doesn't, nothing else will. Voila! My whiskers! My lovely whiskers! Gone! What have you done? Oh! The vast and empty desert, does it not stir your imagination? No! Go away! <laughs> Never will I leave your side, O oh Great One! <laughs> Rocco, have you seen Gertie anywhere? Last time I saw her, she and the Reg were making peanut butter to smear on problem walrus. And um, why for were they doing this? I didn't like to ask. You know what Gertie's like? Hmm, yes indeed. Ah, oh, there you are, Noah. I've come to congratulate you on your handling of the island. I'm glad you're here, actually. Can you tell me about any of the creatures that live around these parts? 
where are we exactly? On the edge of the Arabian desert. Oh, I know what. The Golden Mole. Very rare. Almost a legend. Oh, that would be a thing to have. Yes, yes, that's quite enough from you. Come away, now. A tiresome creature. The Golden Mole is indeed a creature of legend. It is said that they bring great luck to travelers, and although they are blind, they fear nothing because they see nothing. Most intrepid creatures, though small and of a cuddlesome nature, they possess great strength. Pity those unwise enough to stand in their path. A mole, excuse me, is a horrible, smelly thing. Shush, 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 Sasha. Poisky, poisky. But there is more. In fact, the most important and remarkable thing. What's that, Salome? It is said that if you tell a golden mole where you want to go, it will point the way exactly. Point the way? Diamantina, of course. It can provide lucky passage all the way straight to Diamantina. I'd like to find one. What's it look like? A bit like Sasha, I suppose, but without the funny nose. And no eyes, and covered with golden fur. How dare you compare me to a mole? Which is, excuse me, a disgusting and ugly thing which I am not. Oisky, boisky, bushna, brutta. Salome! Can you get Rocco to organize the cleaning of the beaches? I'm off to the desert to find a golden mole. Sasha, you're coming with me. Can I go now? Yes, I don't think I can get much more in now. See you later for your next load. Bye. Here comes Mammoth's body. This must be his tenth load. Well done, Mammoth's body. Only another fifty loads to go. Only another fifty loads, he says. Oh, my ancient back. Oh. Where do you want me to take this, Rocco? Just there will do nicely. Thank you very much. Struth! This is a right malarkey and no mistake. Never doubt the Great One, for he is the most brilliant of creatures. <laughs> That's better. Right, you two. Get over there and do your stuff. Well, really. I don't know. Not a please or thank you there, have you? Ordering us about like that. Who does he think he is? I'm Rocco, that's who. <gasps> a bear of my position, levelling sand. I ask you. Phew. Oh, I think I'll have a bit of a sit down before I go for the next load. Crikey! Right. Please, this is not a game, but a most serious business. You are spoiling everything. Um, Ursula? I am speechless with outrage. <laughs> <laughs> I've told you ten times, Sparky. The desert is no place for a rabbit. Go back to the island. Go on. No. Go home. It's not safe for you here. I'm not telling you again. Oh. <laughs> rabbit. <laughs> Hey, bunny hopper, mate. I'm looking for scorpions. Want to help? 
wait. Follow me. Whoopee! Come on, Cobber. It's great. Come on, it's fun. Hello, boy, Sparky. <laughs> Super duper thing, scorpions. Sting you dead in a second if they're in a temper. <laughs> I'll have to annoy them. That's my game. Come on, copper. Yoo-hoo! This is Noah speaking. Any golden moles down there? Hello! Captainski. Anyone there? Yelling into the sand in this way is, excuse me, the most foolish behavior. Oh, can you suggest another way we might contact a golden mole? There is something about myself, Captain Skip, which you do not know. Something terrible. Poor Sasha. What can it possibly be? I am, excuse me, myself, personally, a mole. But, Sasha, what are you saying? Desmonds and moles are cousins. We are very similar. <laughs> oh, Sasha, is that so bad to be a mole? Terrible. Shameful. <laughs> I will burrow like a mole because I am like a mole. <gasps> I will find the hideous golden cousin for you. Sasha, you don't have to. Sasha. Sasha. Sasha! My, that wind is picking up. Sasha! Sasha! Mm, Reg, pet, you are a clever monkey. I can go to your parasol. It's the bonniest thing I think I ever had. <sighs> Just you wait. Reg has better fun planned out. We'll find ourselves a camel, milk it, then I'll make butter in my homemade china here. <laughs> It'll improve my peanut butter no end. Oh, Red, you are so civilized. But we got to find a camel first. How do you do? <laughs> you little... Oh! <laughs> oh, 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 you should see it. It's a big one, a beaut. <laughs> Suit yourself. I'm going to have another go. Make him really angry this time. <laughs> um, right. Ooh, that's not very refined, is it, Bonnie Lass? Spit him. I made a bargain with your little man. I'll donate my milk for your butter, but I'm allowed to spit at you when I like. Really? Any minute now, this camel milk will turn to butter. Oh, goody, a sandstorm. All aboard, ladies and gents, we'll be buried alive. Tally ho! Ha ha ha! Tally ho! <coughs> Sasha! <coughs> Sasha! Where are you? desert wastes for another mole. Oh, darling, I love you. Oh, what a beaut of a sandstorm. Inspiring, that's what. Look at that. This blinking storm is blowing the hoil away. Cool. You're blooming right, monkey chops. Do 
Don't leave me. My love, my darling. Don't go. Oh, oh, please, madame, control yourself. Oh, whisky! Captain Ski! Ah, Sasha. Oof. There you are. Captain Ski, are you quite well? Uh, <coughs> never felt better. Thank you, Sasha. <coughs> oh, 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 Sasha, you found one. A golden mole. A rare and beautiful little mammal. Sasha, you clever fellow. To my eternal regret, I must inform you, Captain Ski, that we are, despite my protests, engaged to be married. Married? Yes, married. Oi, yoy, 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 a bootstrap, isn't he a darling? Uh, uh, this is absolutely marvelous. <laughs> Yippee, hooray! Oh, I'm so pleased to see you. <laughs> well, I'll be blowed. Giraffe, an orange uten, a blinking monkey, four hyenas, a bandicoot, and hard bark, and a, um, a, a what's his name, a cowardly lion, a baby elephant, a poodly dog, a panda, a bear, a beetle, a mongoose, a bald walrus, a doodah, and an oceros. I think that's everyone. No, it's not actually. Who have I missed then, the blinking marsupial? Everyone's accounted for, except them what's on shore, and the mammoths. God, the blinking mammoths! How could I have missed them? Um, over here, I do say, if you don't mind. Um, hello, any wonder? I'd say Struth if I was you, Wu. Struth? Absolutely. It means everything to me to be so close to you. Oh, not now, Mammoth's body. We'd better dig them out. Yes. back to the island. Oh, if only we had a camel, we'd get there much quicker. <laughs> How do you do? Is it absolutely necessary for you to do that? I'm most dreadfully sorry, but I can't help it. I'm a camel, and camels spit. I say, you are a camel, aren't you? You couldn't do us a favor, could you? That's much better. We'll get there in no time now. Boisky, boisky. I don't suppose you have anything to do with a butter-fixated monkey, a loopy gorilla, a mad wombat, and a strangely quiet rabbit that I met on my travels. Why, yes, that's the rest of our shore party. Are they well? And do you know where they are? Yes, they're just beyond the next dune. All are well enough. That's marvellous news. I really feel our new golden friend is bringing us luck already. Digging. Oof. You can say that again, Wu. Noah, it's our captain with the rest of the gang on some hump a lumping camel. Hello, Rocco, Woomera. It's good to see you. Hey, what's that Noah's got with him? Never one of them golden moles, is it? It blinking is. Well, what a funny-looking scrap of fur that is, eh? Yes, 
do not be speaking, excuse me, about my fiancé in a disrespectful manner. Oops, sorry. Uh, uh, um, congrats, uh, Sasha, old lad. Is it true? Yes, Rocco. Blimey. Hello. Your faith in me will be restored or just thumping one. Behold what I have found. Another, Another golden, golden ball. Ball. Going on, Pat. Poor little Sasha, jilted by his mole. Never mind, Pat. Come to Gertie. I've been hurt too, you know. I've lost my lovely parasol. Hmm. Well, I think I'll be going. It's all a bit soppy for me round here. Tittle Pip! What's up with her? Got the ump, I suppose, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Goes closed aft valve in one minute. I, I come. Now then, my two golden beauties, you are coming with me. Come on. Now then, which way is north? Diamantina. Oh. Deary B, I don't believe it. I know. Which one of you is right? Ah! Excuse me. I got this problem, Noah, and I was wondering if I could borrow them golden moles of yours. Well, they're not really my golden moles, but I'm sure they would be delighted to help you solve a problem. Oh. Thank you most kindly, Captain Noah. In the meantime, I've got to have a word with that Salome. Noah! Noah! Look! Ha! I got my whiskers back! Ha! 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 Oh, dear. 